Five, we have breaking news. Atlanta police just sharing new video of two suspects they're seeking in a deadly shooting near Atlantic Station. Police also confirming a second child has now died from that gunfire. Let's get straight out to Joe Ripley live from the 17th Street Bridge close to where this happened on Saturday night. And Joe, you just got an update from Atlanta police. They are now asking for the public's help here. That's right. Uh, good evening to you. Atlanta police tonight asking for the public's help in identifying two people they believe shot uh, uh, Zion Charles and a number of other people as well outside of Atlantic Station here on the 17th Street Bridge. We've also learned a second victim has died. 15 year old Cameron Jackson is his name. And uh, police telling us not only are they looking for these two people, they're calling primary suspects in this shooting, but also a lot of other boys you're about to look at in this video. Let's take a watch. Here and you can see this group of young folks walking alongside the, the sidewalk there. This is moments before the shooting, police say. They say the boy in the yellow coat you see in their bottom left, that is Zion Charles, the 12 year old killed Saturday night, who's part of that group. Police say they believe the boy in the black and yellow jacket and blue jeans was the primary shooter. Police are also looking for the boy in the blue hoodie with white lettering who they believe also fired shots that night. They say immediately after the shooting, the group went into the Art Center Mar uh, murder station and took the train to different stops, harassing passengers, flashing gang signs, and showing their weapons to other passengers. Police believe the shooting that night was specifically targeting Cameron, who passed the group as he rode a scooter to Atlantic Station with two of his friends. They say uh, that's Cameron, that's our position. That's when shots rang out. The shots directed to Cameron, that's when you have all the other collateral people that were shot. All the bullets were meant for Cameron. Zion took the bullet. He's deceased on the scene. And then we have the other uh, victims that was also shot. Everything was directed to Cameron. So Cameron and Zion both deceased tonight. There were four others who were shot. We we're told they've been released from the hospital after getting treated. Police, though, are still working to figure out what exactly led up to Saturday night shooting and why was Cameron targeted in the first place. Crime Stoppers is upping their reward. If you have any information leading to an arrest, a $10,000 reward is up for grabs there. You do not have to give your name.